Okay, so we are now going to go over how to do limit orders. So let me ask you, do you know anything about limit orders or stop orders, Michelle? No, you know no, nothing? I don't. Okay, so the nothing. way it works is you set a price that you want Bitcoin to buy at. So if you were on Coinbase right now and you click the buy button, you would be buying uh, Bitcoin at $6,094, okay? But see, what you mm -hmm. can do instead is I don't like to pay attention on when I buy. So what I do is I set limit orders. So what I do is... I want to buy more Bitcoin, especially if Bitcoin goes under 6,000. I think it's a great time to get in. And we just talked about how you want to dollar cost average $250, right? So mm -hmm. let's just go ahead and have it where you're buying $150 of Bitcoin and maybe $100 of altcoin. Or what do you feel? Like, do you think you should be buying more Bitcoin or more altcoins? I mean, um, you already have a lot of Bitcoin. Yeah, yeah. I think um, I definitely want to diversify. Okay, so let's mm. just say your goal right now is to buy about $150 worth of Bitcoin, $100 of altcoins. So what you're going to do is you're going to set up three buys at $50. You can make it different. So if you wanted to, you can make it $25. But to make it easier, we're going to say you're going to buy three times Bitcoin, and then you're going to buy two different altcoins. And do you know what altcoins you want to buy? Um, I haven't looked into any of them. Okay, so Just I'm going to recommend the ones are on the Ethereum. I mm -hmm. think Ethereum's a great altcoin. It's a number two coin. In fact, let me just show uh -huh. you this uh, lit chart. You should definitely, when you get a chance, study this chart. Um, so yes, Bitcoin is the number one. It's the king. Um, so I highly recommend Ethereum. And then if you're, you're going to be using Coinbase Pro, the next biggest coin you can buy is Bitcoin Cash. Um, mm -hmm. so you can do Bitcoin cash. You can also do Litecoin. Do you have a preference of which one you want to buy? Maybe like one time you uh, buy Litecoin, the other time you buy Bitcoin cash to make it easier. We're yeah, going to do, yeah. do the big four, right? These, these are the top four mm -hmm. coins. So you're going to do Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Bitcoin cash. So now we're going to go back to our trading window. And so what you do is you're going to put a limit order here. We're going to start with Bitcoin, right? So, um, mm -hmm. you basically want to buy at 6,100. So... We're going to wait for the price. If the price goes down to, let's just say, 6075 you're going to have to now buy, let's say, I don't think you can do 0 0.1. So if you do 0 0.01 Bitcoin, it's going to be $60, which is close to the 50. Remember how we were saying that? So let's just say yeah. you're going to buy 0 0.0, or here, we can actually make it closer. We can do 0 0.07, no, 0 0.08. There you go. This is going to be about $50. So if you buy 0 0.008 Bitcoin at 675 all you're going to do is put a limit. So if it hits that price, so if Bitcoin goes down to uh, 675, it automatically executes. So you could be asleep. Oh, that's cool. You could be working out at the gym. You could be working at your banking job, you know, <laughs> or doing HR. Yeah. Um, so you're going to set one now, <laughs> but what we're going to do is we're going to scale it. Remember how I was saying you're going to dollar cost average. So you're going to now put in an order. Um, so at 675, you're going to hit place by order, but then let's just do another price too. Now, if it goes down to five, nine, I don't know, eight, nine, you're going to buy a little more Bitcoin. See, so if it goes under 6,000 at five here, I'll actually make it even easier. So if it goes to 599, you're going to buy now yeah. another one, right? And then now you can make one more purchase for your dollar cost average for the month. So you're going to set another price at, um, let's just do it if it drops another hundred dollars. So five, nine, nine, there you go. So now you have three purchases, you know, one is at 6,000, one is at 5,900 and one is at 58, right? So you're scaling it. So mm -hmm. if the price continues to buy, you buy more Bitcoin. If it doesn't, whatever, you already have $1,000 of Bitcoin you're sitting, sitting on. Um, and like I said, if it goes for a week or two where you haven't been able to hit an order, then you might want to just buy market or just set up your price a little higher. So it actually then finally picks up. But usually since we're in a bear market, it's going to hit. So just be patient. Don't be in a rush to buy. Um, so that's good. Okay. And now you want to mm -hmm. now do the other altcoins, right? So you would just come over here yeah. and let's go ahead and do uh, Ethereum. So Ethereum is, oops, sorry. I didn't do Ethereum BTC. Where is Ethereum? Okay, here we go. So Ethereum's at $260. So let's just say you're going to buy, um, I think you're going to have to buy like 0.2 Ethereum. And let's set the price at 250 and see what that comes out at. Yeah, so if you buy two, it's going to be exactly 50 bucks. You see that at 250 So you'll set an order now. So if Ethereum drops down to 250 boom, you're buying Ethereum, right? Oh, nice. Yeah. Okay. And then let's go ahead and go down to, let's say, 220. Now you'll buy a little more. 
And now um, go to your other altcoin you were going to buy. So we're going to go to um, Bitcoin Cash USD. And once again, you're going to do the same thing. So Bitcoin Cash is at uh, $488. So you just go to your limit order. You're going to buy, we're, we're going to try to buy some Bitcoin Cash at 450 And I think you need point like two or something. Not two Bitcoin Cash, point two. No, point one. Okay, so if you buy point one right now, it'll be at $45. So you can set one at four, 450 and 400 Does that make sense? Yeah. So now if these prices happen, it's going to hit. And so that's like the 250 you're trying to invest. Now, you said mm -hmm. you wanted to invest a thousand dollars, right? Yeah. Sorry, uh, yeah. five thousand. Well, five thousand, right? So yeah, five thousand. We're gonna now mm -hmm. go over how you can go ahead and spread out your limit orders uh, right now, so you don't even have to pay attention. So if it goes to lower prices, you can even buy more. But I'm gonna make another video mm -hmm. on that since we went like almost okay. six minutes. So, all right, thank you for watching, okay. guys.